So today marks the final episode for Punishment Packs in Madden 18. Today, you could say it's a sad day for some of you guys, but for me, oh boy, do I feel great about it. After this, I won't have to worry about doing stupid forfeits for... No, wait. Never mind. I'm gonna be doing it for Madden 19. Regardless, today should be a pretty fun episode. Today's forfeit, discarding everybody that we pull. It's been the standard deal. We've done it before. It sucks. I loaded up about 6,000 points for us to spend. The main reason behind maybe what some of you would consider a low amount of points are these suckers right here. Six stand appreciation packs. As a mutt connoisseur, I like being appreciated. I can't let these packs go to waste. So we're gonna open up six of these. I'm gonna throw a couple more points on. We're gonna open up two Ultimate Legend Fantasy packs to cap it off. Every single player that we pull will be put into consideration on who is going to be starting in our lineup. No other players besides the people that we pull can be put in. Unless if we don't pull that position, then a bronze or silver card has to go in that spot. It's a challenge, it's a pack opening, it's a lot of fun, and it gets pretty nerve wracking. Last time I lost, I'm pretty sure. Let's make sure we don't do that again, and let's get into this one. Fan appreciation pack number one. I might split up the packs, do three, then switch to the ultimate legend pack. We'll see how they're going in order for me to make my decision. Already a 93 Sterling Sharp tight end, a right tackle, a 92 cornerback, all right. Our last card would be a left guard, but I'm not a rapper. If you see the amount of coins that I have and you're wondering where they went, they got stolen, we're just gonna leave it at that. I really hope you enjoy that money that you got for selling my coins. Ah, but we're just gonna open the packs and forget about it. So these packs normally, I don't know, I'd say they're hit or miss, but every time I've opened up one of them, they've been pretty bad. I haven't pulled anybody over a 93, I don't think. Oh, well, there's a 93 right there. How great. You know, I know what you're doing right now, mm. and I don't like it. But then again, at the same time, can I really be satisfied with a 93 Victor Cruz as our best card and a fan appreciation pack? <sighs> Ew, don't know. I'm always down for the superstition packs. How about a nose pack? to open this one up. Am I sure? Of course I'm sure that I want to open it. It's a nose pack. It hasn't failed me yet. Probably because I haven't tried it yet, but, but still. Oh, a Bo Jackson. Too bad that wasn't a little bit of a better version. Nose pack, not treating us great in 92. So many of those 92s and please, just one time, the nose, the no oh, not a terrible pull. And I say that because if I trigger this guy off, he'll probably sit on my face and suffocate me. I feel like I've made my decision on what I'm gonna do. We're gonna open up all the fan appreciation packs first. How about a stand on the chair and spinning around pack? This is definitely not safe, so. Ow, I keep hitting my head off of my ceiling fan and uh, we're really not getting too many great things. The last card is a 93. I'm gonna sit down because I'm really dizzy. Ouch. So a quick recap, Lamar Jackson, Kevin Williams, Kirkpatrick, Allen McClendon. <laughs> not treating me well so far, just really not. A super quick one, that did not help. We only have one more of these before we move on to the Ultimate Legend Fantasy Pack, an 89 Hayward Bay, an 85, and our last one, a 92. So again, the best card that we get as far as overall goes, it's only a 94. That makes me sad. I specifically targeted these packs so I could be appreciated, and I got clickbaited. Another thing, I don't know how to do math, so we're gonna open up one of these, then one of these, and then back to one of these. I feel like I have more luck with the regular Legends Fantasy Pack than this one. I don't know if this is just because it's two rounds or what, but I keep seeing people pull just crazy things in these, and it just makes me wanna go for them. I'll go left guard, because I don't know if I have a left guard yet. And then round two, two, we get... A fat slob. The next card will be... <laughs> it's worse. What's next? An 83? Is that what you're gonna give me? A 91 John Randall. Wow, is this bad. I'm gonna take him just because he's a 91. You know what? I can open up three of these instead of doing one and one, so I'm gonna do that instead. Like I said, I feel like I have a little bit more luck opening up these. We pulled the Calvin Johnson. I pulled a couple limited time 99 overalls as well in them. So if I pull anything in any of these packs, it'll probably be these ones. Round two of three is gonna be a Robert Kelly, all right? See, I gotta be paying attention. I know we don't have a fullback yet, but I gotta pay attention to the positions that we need, which I really haven't done now. That great of a job on Yowch. Okay, Randy Moss will be decent in our lineup at least. So if they could hear me on the other end of the screen, I have not pulled in a golden ticket card yet. I have spent a lot of money on this game and the fact that I haven't gotten a single one kind of really makes me question life. So if you wouldn't mind either in this pack or the next pack to set me up with one, I, I don't know, it'd be pretty cool. Last card, trash. Well, 
considering he's as tall as a street light, I think Carmichael's a good pick. It'll be kind of cool being able to use the combination of him and Randy Moss on the same team. We didn't really luck out with the cards exactly that we pulled because they're both 80s, but I mean, nonetheless, it's going to be two pretty sick cards. I think they perform pretty well despite their overalls. Now in our last round, whatever, let's just pick these guys through and move on to our last couple rounds. Give me an elite. Oh, 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 an 89 kicker. <laughs> Probably our best pull of the day. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm going to take a kicker, an 80. Nine kicker. And then a Mike Evans. Okay, so we got some sick wide receivers. Oh, it's about dang time. 97, Eric Allen. And in our last pack, can we wrap it up with somebody good? No. Lose some weight. You look like a fridge. But come on, though. At least we had one decent pull, Eric Allen, in our lineup. Now, there's one specialty pack that I'm going to open, all right? And whenever I say special, I mean really special. Ah, shoot. What did I just click on? Cut. Wait, what is this? Um, is this it? Oh, shoot, this is it. Okay, this is it. The Ultimate Legend Giveaway Set Reward. We're guaranteed a 98 or 99 overall player. We get to pick one person. We did this last time. Ended up with Barry Sanders once. We pulled a Brian Erlacher out of it. These packs are lit. I really don't want Kevin Williams, though, so hopefully we can do a little bit better. Card number two. Okay, Willie McGinnis, sure. Let's go ahead for card number three. Let down. Stop showing up in my packs. I don't want you. Ah, anyways, let's move ahead on to our last car, which is gonna be. You can get duplicates. I genuinely don't know what to say. I almost want to think that this is fake, but it's clearly not. Wow, okay. After that though, our defense is looking like this. I think our three best players actually come on defense. Willie McGinnis, Eric Allen, and Jonathan Hankins. Let's move over to offense so you guys can see what I have to deal with. Dan Marino, 89 quarterback, 93, Bo Jackson, some decent receivers. We put Victor Cruz at wide receiver number three. I just, I don't know. I just feel like those other guys got more skill. And then our offensive line, tight end's not bad. We have Eddie Lacy at fullback. All the cards that you see on defense, including the Allen, including the McGinnis, are going to be on the line for this game. If we lose, every single one of these guys are going to be put up on the auction block for the minimum price. What is it, 150 coins? Now what you got to realize, we're going to be at a severe disadvantage. Yeah, <laughs> okay, so this is a, his third best player is better than our first best player. And I'm sure that he has a fourth and fifth best player that's better than our best guy. To my team, you might as well start packing up your bags right now because this game's over. Honestly, just get yourself ready right now and just be posted really cheap on the auction block. Well, at least I could try to give this a little bit of a try, make this kind of competitive. That would be really ideal, actually. Oh, wait, hold on a second. That's, that's a pretty good start to this game. Game. Yeah, let, let's hold off. You guys can come back to the team. Don't pack those bags up just yet. Oh, come on now. Watch them quit. Honestly, you know what? You can go ahead and do that if you'd like. I for sure wouldn't be opposed to it. Randy Moss looking like he's trying to lock him up with no extra help there. Whenever I see that, it means one thing. We hit the out route and get a nice play. Now we'll send Moss deep. I, I don't really like what I sell. Let the ball out of your hand. Uh, okay, he decided to take a 12 yard loss. I don't like that. This time will be a nice pass to try. Oh, wow. I was going to try to get those yards back. Not right there, though. I'm thinking about maybe our best player as far as overall goes. Nope. Randy Moss got to go for that user cap. He just got straight up Moss. Randy Moss got mossed. Oh, we're playing man coverage. Instead, we bring the blitz. Got him down. Oh, our middle linebackers are so weak to use. Edmonds is our best guy. He's an 86 overall. This, who's his quarterback? Some guy that's really quick. It'll be another pass if he takes off one more time. I'm for sure going to be putting a quarterback spy here on this play. Sent somebody in. Oh, th how is not that a fumble? I'm trying to send some heat from that right side to keep people underneath. Wow, that actually came in fast. McGinnis, sack. We're just going to have to do everything on our own. Deep pass. I'm user in Allen. Allen now, McGinnis, Allen, combo, mambo deal. I wanted to take that right, but left doesn't seem too bad. Wow, he's quick. He's nimble. Oh, hit him with that play action right there. Wow, so much heat. It just comes in so fast. Ah, oh, dude, I didn't want to do that. I'm just going to throw up a high point pass and just start praying. And another pick. I should have just punted the ball. That's another one to Sean Taylor. No, that's Barry Sanders this time. Okay, Deion Sanders isn't doing that. Deion Sanders would go down quicker than Tom Brady. I don't even want to hear it. Now we got ourselves in a tight spot. He's going deep yet again. Williams going up. Swat that. Run on him. Come on. Big fumble. And he gets it. Yep. And he's going to get like five more. He just gets yards out of it too. He flipped it again. I remember him doing this before. I think it was a run play last time he did it. This time it's not a run play. <sighs> We're going to have to clap back quick if we want this. Don't. That's... 
that's not exactly doing that, you know? What am I doing? Why didn't I set up Hayward Bay there? Instead, Hayward Bay is going to be the one blocking. Let's see. Just gonna, we're just gonna go to the next play. Looking for somebody here. Inside pass, possession. God, I just missed it. Remember, this guy doesn't have any timeouts left. He's probably gonna go for one more play and then try to kick a field goal and get up by the necessary amount of points that he needs to. Oh! <laughs> I can't play this game. That should have been picked. Am I right or am I like just dumb? Because that might have been one of the most questionable touchdowns I've ever seen. I'm still not gonna get over that last touchdown that this guy had. That middle was wide open. I don't know why he decided to go. They were strafing. Okay. Really going to be embarrassing showing that play. Let's get this over with, huh? Willie McGinnis. I can't auction him, so we will quick sell him. Okay, Adam Vinatieri goes for 50k. Alone. He's a kicker. Somebody's really going to enjoy this one. A killer Eric Allen on the auction for 500 coins. Carmichael. This card's probably not worth that much, but whatever. Randy Moss. Peace out, bro. Yeah, sure. We'll discard you. I will let you go. Ugh, this one kind of sucks. There's only a couple more guys. I'm just going to get them all real quick, and then we're going to end this one off. Well, That'll be that. I am your boy Pizza. This was the last punishment packs of Madden 18. The past two have been brutal. Like, I haven't even come close in these, which makes me really question whether or not I should be doing them. If I'm doing this during Madden 19, I will probably break down in tears. Uh, I'm not even going to try to think about that. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this series in Madden 18. If you did, if you liked all the episodes, if you have been here for all the episodes, let me know down in the comments so I can personally thank you. Let me know by dropping a like, especially if you made it to the end of the video and put up with that disaster that I just showed you guys. And until next time, guys, I'm your boy Pizza. Do not forget to keep God number one. And until next time, I'm your boy and I'm out. Peace out. We're out of here. I got smoked. 21 nothing. The last punishment pack, I think I lost by like 28 points. What's wrong with me? Okay, so I found all this change. Tails, I'm still good at this game. Heads, I'm bad. Heads, heads, heads. Heads, heads, heads. Oh, come on. Wait, there's one more. Where's it at? Oh, that's heads too. Shocker. <laughs>